What's going on guys? Bow here back with some anime ninja. So let's get into this. We got the new events out and we did actually get the growth plan. So that's pretty good there. We're going to be getting hopefully quite a bit of gold. I don't know how much we're actually going to get out of it, but uh, we're going to see if we can get at least a couple thousand. Let me just grab all this stuff real quick. We also got the ninja treasure, which is going to help us out. We also got the weapon guide, which I'm hoping to actually get some more of the god set i mean my luck with that is pretty bad so we'll probably end up just getting one piece which is fine but uh I do want to finish that off because that does give us agility and then we're also gonna hope to get some more of the universal ones so that way we can also finish that one off but uh yeah we got the ninja treasure which i believe is the exact same as the previous one so i don't think they changed anything i think they're the same price as well but uh, we're not going to be getting anybody out of this one just yet. I know I probably have enough to get somebody, but we want to start saving up even more. But let's check the boxes. Yeah, they're... everything seems the same. Same price. Kakashi with 400 points. So yeah, you get 50 spins for, what is it? Uh, how many points? I forgot. 50 points for... 4,000 gold or something like that and then we also got this as well let me actually check what we're going to be getting since we are going to be getting some of these it looks like we're going to be getting basic fury which is really nice i don't know how far we're actually going to go on that but hopefully we'll at least get a couple of the basic furies and we got the nothing there we got 30 so you get 30 points a day we're hoping for something good not going to be topping up on this one. I know you get a basic theory, a little bit of gold, but uh, we got the rebate here for 200%. I think that's more than it gave us last time. I'm not too sure though. But uh, on this one, you're not going to be getting that much. As you can see here, we're getting about 100 on each of these, 120. And on these last two, you do have a chance to get a lot more, 280. And this one, you have a chance to get the most. Someone, I seen somebody did get uh, 10k before, so you can get it which would be pretty nice to get, but uh, I doubt we're going to be getting anything good. And we got two, we got 10 extra gold there because you have a chance to get 5,250, I think it is. So yeah, we didn't get nothing out of that basically. Not even worth it at that point. I don't think you have to spend five, no, you get a chance to get 250. So we got 260, not worth it. I really wish we would have got a couple thousand because we're close to 16 and if we would have got or if we were able to get up to 20 we would have been able to get this plan which is really nice because it basically doubles the 20k but uh we're only gonna double eight which i guess is still good because we're gonna get 16 back but uh doubling 20 would be amazing because we'd get 40 back and then we could actually go and um do the 41 next time so I think that's what I'm going to start saving up my stuff for I am gonna wait till tomorrow to actually buy the plan and the only reason I'm gonna do that is because we're gonna get back more coupons if we actually do it that way so there's no reason to rush it I know it's gonna be an extra day to wait but uh, it's gonna take 20 days to get back all that gold anyway and we're probably not gonna have a growth plan probably within that 20 days I don't think but even if we do we still have an extra 8,000 with us so but uh, yeah I think that's the best way to do it right now save up all the gold you have for gold change and growth plan and just keep doubling all your gold save about 40 40 is about what you're gonna need for both of them and just keep doubling and then whatever you get after that is what you're going to be spending so that's how i'm going to do it i was really hoping to double 20k but uh we're actually four short so yeah i don't have enough to top up for that much but uh after that four after we get to that 20 and then we get that 40 from that 40 we do the 40 40k plan and then uh, whatever goal we get out of that is basically what you're gonna spend but uh, that should be enough to get characters and stuff like that every month if we continue to get the growth plan at 200% I think we usually get it at 150 or something like that but still that's a lot of gold extra 
when you're spending 40,000, so... An extra 40,000 is a lot. Even an extra, like, 30,000 is gonna be a lot. But, uh, yeah, I think that's how I'm gonna do it. It's gonna take us probably two to three months to actually get both of those done. And for us to have enough gold. But once we hit that point, we'll be able to buy a ton of characters and stuff like that. So hopefully, they keep doing the grow plan and keep doing the gold change, because I'm gonna keep doing them for as long as they continue to put them out. But uh, that means we're going to have to wait on buying like a Vanguard or another Assaulter or anything like that out of any of the events. Which is fine because I think in the long run it'll be a lot better. But hopefully they don't change up the events because they keep changing them. Like the goal change used to be a lot better than it was before. You used to get a ton more gold out of it. And it used to cost a lot less. But uh, they actually made it cost a lot more and you don't get back as much unless you have like 20k at the start so but even then you still get quite a bit of gold so it's actually worth it I think you can get about 5k maybe even more depending on how lucky you actually get if you do the gold change all the way through and they usually have gold change every month I don't think they usually have the growth plan every month but um, even if they do have the growth plan every month sometimes it's not gold so we just gotta wait for when it is gold I will be able to increase our gold like crazy. But uh, yeah, this time we're only going to be able to get 8. So that kind of sucks. I was just shy of actually getting it. Just shy. 4,000 off of actually getting a good 40k gold, which would have been nice. But um, maybe on the next one, probably another 2-3 to three months, and we should have enough gold to wear... We can start getting some characters and stuff like that. Plus, we're actually getting back a ton of coupons on this event as well. We should be able to hit somewhere past 10,000 at least. Because tomorrow we are going to wait and buy the plan then for the 8,000. Because if I do it now... Oh, look at that. The, whatever we got today is already up to 9. So, yeah, easily 10k tomorrow. But uh, we're going to be buying the 8,000 tomorrow since... Um, there's no reason to do it today since we only need to spend 390 I think it was or three something yeah I think it was 390 more coupons and then we'll be able to get back another 700 coupons so yeah we're just gonna do it like that tomorrow we'll spend the eight plus we're gonna get back a bunch of basic fear from that as well which is perfect so we're getting there we definitely are getting there like I mean I would have enough right now if I wanted to, to get a character but then that would leave us with basically nothing. We would have to start with nothing to get back up. So we're just going to wait and uh, hope we can save up enough before they change around the events. Or hopefully they just leave them the same. They're perfectly fine the way they are. But uh, yeah, they're always changing their events around and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, pretty good events if you do have gold. Going to be able to get back some gold and stuff like that so but yeah the best option is just to save up to 40 because if I had 40k gold right now that'd be perfect because you basically make 80k off of the the pack which is insane that's a lot of gold to make but it took me forever to get to what I'm at now so <laughs> unless you're topping up thousands and thousands of gold it's gonna take you a while but once you get there it's gonna be pretty good but uh, let's just get all this stuff done but yeah that's gonna be about the event there's really nothing else I mean yeah ninja treasure if you're gonna be getting stuff and that's about it I mean the weapon guide but uh, that honestly I have such bad luck with that that uh, we're probably only going to get one piece for each of the sets. I'm hoping at least, at least get one piece for each of them. So that way next time we have it around, we'll get another piece or something like that. Because right now I'm missing four pieces for the God set. Which is pretty bad considering I see a ton of people with the full set. And the Universal we're missing two. So that one might be a little bit easier to obtain. And if you're wondering why you actually should get the full set, you do get, I think it's like a thousand something agility off of them so that's a lot of agility to have on a character 
with uh, just the set. Although, like, the reincarnated set and stuff like that's gonna be a lot better, of course, but uh, those are harder to level up. Which I am still working on right now, is gaining material and stuff like that, and, uh... Not, I haven't really been doing the Lost Tower, since if I try the reincarnated one, I only get to, like, stage 5, so... Right now, not worth it, but, um... When I get a lot stronger, it'll probably be worth it. And then once we get those sets, start, uh... As forging them and stuff like that, it'll be perfect. And we might have enough to buy the stone now. We could actually buy the stone on this one and get even more Fury. I might end up doing that, depending on how much coupons we have. We're gonna have about 10, I believe. So, now would probably be a pretty good time to do it. Maybe we'll see you tomorrow, depending on how much, uh more we need to get to the coupons i'll see if it's going to be worth it to buy tomorrow or the next day so that way we can get back even more coupons plus a ton of fury and uh a bunch of other stuff so yeah, i think that works out for the best perfect time to save up for it too but uh yeah we'll be spending four on that still have about six or seven thousand left over depending on how much we get and then, of course, all the gold we're going to have when we actually get it all back next month. And the next event's probably going to be Black Market since they've been giving us all this gold. That's usually how they work. So that way you spend all your gold. By the time they have another gold change or plan or anything like that, they usually throw up a Black Market or other events that make you spend gold. So... Yeah, currently we're just shy of 12. We should be able to hit 12 on the next one. Let's actually spend the amount we need. We're just going to buy agility jades because I do need a ton of agility and we're trying to get as many as we can right now. Just so we can uh, get our agility up for sure. Alright, um, let me grab that. But tomorrow we're going to be spending 8, so we'll get that. We might even be spending the extra 4, depending if, on if it's worth it. Or if we should wait till tomorrow or till the next day to buy the stone. But we will be buying the stone, so we'll have that done, which is going to be pretty nice. We don't have to worry about it anymore. And I could start leveling up like one item at a time. Because it's going to take forever to level them up. But once I get them leveled, they are going to be a pretty good set to wear. Probably throw it on Monketsu or something like that. We'll see. We'll see how it works out. But we saw all this stuff. But uh, yeah, I think that's going to be about it. Pretty good event if you have gold. If you don't, um, start saving up gold, I guess. Uh, well, at least you get the weapon guide and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, pretty good event. I'm just hoping they don't change this event up too much. I mean, I know they can have coupons sometimes as well. But uh, as long as they can continue to have gold in the growth plan every once in a while, it's going to be fine. But, uh... Yeah, I think that's going to be about it for now. There's really nothing else I can do. I know it's going to take us a while to get some characters, but once we actually start getting characters, it's going to be a lot more fun since we're going to be able to buy a ton of them but uh let me just see what else we have i think that's it honestly oh yeah we got to do the potency still working on potency for obito as you can see here probably get him up one or two ah uh, yeah we got him up to 84 so he's slowly getting there i mean i could get him up a lot higher if i actually just go into the elite matches and bought the boxes or something like that for the pills but uh yeah, I don't think it's worth it, so... And I was wondering how much these boxes are. So, this one costs 80. Wow, that's a lot. That's 4k for 50 points. Yeah, that's not worth it. Because I still need an S weapon. I'll probably just level up my S weapons at this point with gold. But, um, yeah, I think that's going to be about it. We'll buy the packs tomorrow and... Just continue to save up, so... Hopefully you guys are going to be doing the same, but we'll talk to you guys next time.